Welcome back. I'm Kevin McNulty. Friday's blizzard robbed us of a top five matchup in boys basketball. Number four Marquette at number two Menominee. That game was rescheduled for tonight. It was well worth the wait. The Maroons last in action 12 days ago. Marquette coming off a win over Ishpeming last Wednesday. First few minutes of the second half. Menominee up 28-25. Jackson Jermu inside to Jacob McPhee. Back out to Kyler Sager for the triple. And we are tied. On the other end, the quarterback, Trevor Turkoff. With it in the corner, he sinks a triple of his own. And we go back and forth. Sager with it now. Dishes to Jack Quinnell, who finds a sneaky Jackson Jermu right under the hoop for two. Turkoff again, backing down Jermu, and he won't be denied. Puts up the jumper with the defense right in his face. That one falls for the Maroons. They turn defense into offense now. Turkoff picks up the loose ball, goes behind his back, and hits his not-so-little brother Tanner for the layup. But Marquette... Goes to work in the fourth. Jermu off the rebound. Over to McPhee, and the hook shot is money. That one makes it 46-42. Quinnell backing down his man now. There's another layup for the road team. Marquette goes on to win it 64-55. Rich Leedy with his thoughts on Marquette's fourth straight victory. I thought we, we both teams played really hard. It was kind of an ugly first half. Um, you know, it was, it, was a, just a, it was just a big slugfest. Um, two really good teams going at it. Uh, I was really proud of our kids that they showed the guts they did in the second half uh, and just came down to who, who made shots and who didn't. Um, they had a little run there in the first half to get back into it uh, and in the middle of the third quarter, but in the fourth quarter, uh, I thought we wore them down and really proud of the kids. Marquette's back at home tomorrow against Sault Ste. Marie. The Maroons will host Pestigo on Friday.